Hello my beautiful mamas and mamas-to-be. Welcome back to my channel, the Simple Mommy Life channel. My name is Kayla and today I thought it would be pretty cool to do a what's in my diaper bag video. Okay, so what is in my uh, diaper bag? So this is my diaper bag. Uh, I just want to take a moment to appreciate how cute this diaper bag is. This is from Skip Hop and uh, this is like a full leather. It comes in uh, a variety of colors and styles. Uh, you can have the uh, pockets in different locations. Uh, you can purchase this kind of bag with or without this piece on the top. And honestly, it's a very spacious bag. Like it is uh, mind blowing how many things can fit in this small bag. And it's got lots of uh, pockets. Uh, you can access um, your things easily and it comes as well with um, some straps and of course as usual everything uh, that I talk about in this video will be linked in the description box below but moving on from the bag we are going to see what I pack each and every time I leave the house with my baby so the things that I pack for myself are um, the essentials. I like to keep them all in one location. So for myself, I pack my wallet uh, with um, our Medicare cards and, um, you know, all that stuff. Uh, then I also pack a period pad just in case mama needs it, as well as some uh, masks uh, because this is the coronavirus time. So you'll most likely need something like this. And uh, the baby's pacifier, which I keep on this pacifier clip, which I've made myself. Uh, this is uh, a pacifier that has its own clip. So I don't need to think about packing um, something else to carry the clip and the pacifier. And on this side, I carry my baby's bottle. My baby is nine months old, so she is pretty established on solids. But every time I go out, I like to just carry a bottle of pumped breast milk in case she gets hungry uh, and I can't breastfeed her uh, on the spot or I don't have like any snacks. So that I will keep on this side of my bag. And I uh, keep it inside this little container. It's actually a warmer so uh, this is from uh, Prince uh, Lionheart and it's one of these warmers that um, it's like a liquid uh, a liquidy thing and you press the button here on the top and it will turn very hot and keep your milk bottle warm for many hours. If I know that uh, I'm taking the baby out for many hours, you just wrap it around the bottle, stick it in this little pouch, and in uh, the diaper bag it goes. So when you're packing a diaper bag, just a little piece of advice, you really have to think about everything. You have to think about your baby's diapering, uh, what they're going to eat, how they're going to entertain yourself, depending on where you go, uh, if they need uh, special things, uh, weather-related uh, things, sunscreen, a hat, uh, a sweater, all that stuff. So you have to think about everything when you leave the house with your baby. So things that I pack in my diaper bag are, in this small pocket, I keep a little wooden teether that I know that Ileana really likes. And if uh, she's in a teething mood, I can just pop this out and uh, she will teeth on it. I also have a little munch mitt just in case uh, the teether is not interesting for her. I always have a little backup. She kind of uses this as a little toy, something to entertain her in the car or if we're going uh, for a stroll ride, etc. Also, I pack some extra socks because babies lose their socks all the time. And I just keep it in this small pocket because, um, you know, these are all small things. Uh, when you open the diaper bag, you can stretch it out. You can really see all of the contents in the diaper bag easily. You have many pockets on the side that is uh, totally um, easy to access, which is honestly why I love this diaper bag. 
So moving on, I pack a, a portable uh, diaper changing station. This is also from Skip Hop. It's one that you can just open up. It's got uh, plenty of pockets. You just lie it on the floor and you change your baby. Um, it's waterproof and when you're finished with it, you can just close this up, put it back in your uh, bag. I also carry uh, things that I know that I'm going to need while I'm changing the baby. I like to keep it in this like makeup case. <laughs> and uh, basically in here I have her diaper rash cream. I have uh, like also a little birds and bees and a little spray in case her poops are extremely dry. Next I have... Uh, I do uh, cloth diapers, so I always carry with me a cloth diaper wet bag. This one is from Funky Fluff. It's got two pockets, so here I will put the wet diapers um, that I change off her bum. And in here, I keep the white diapers, uh, sorry, the dry diapers, the, the clean ones. And I pack two of them. I pack them into the wet bag and into the diaper bag. I make sure that they are totally prepped. So they are already stuffed with the inserts uh, that I need and uh, they are pretty much ready to go on the baby. So I just have to open the diaper, shum shum, diaper change, close the diaper on the baby, put the old diaper in the diaper bag and I'm off. Also diaper related, I bring some uh, wipes. Uh, these are wipes that I make at home. If you follow my channel, then you know that I am uh, zero waste <laughs> with my baby. Uh, so these are good to go. They are wet and I keep them in this uh, little uh, bag. This is actually from the dollar store and uh, they um, will stay moist and warm and uh, will not leak uh, through this bag and wet the other contents that I have in the diaper bag. Uh, also diaper related, just in case she has like a really, really bad accident or it's not convenient for me to, um, you know, change her into a cloth. I uh, carry a one <laughs> disposable diaper that I have actually never had to use. I'm not even sure if this is her size anymore, but this is always in my diaper bag, just in case. And I keep it in this little pouch that actually came with the Skip Hop um, bag. Um, also, uh, like no longer diaper related, I bring a change of clothes for my baby at all times because you never know when uh, they're going to get dirty or get wet or there's a poop explosion. So I just carry like a little onesie. Um, depending on the weather, I'll pack like a short sleeve or a long sleeve and just a pair of pants that I have in her um, bag just in case. And um, also I carry a uh, drooling bib, I think that's what they're called. And I'll also use this bib uh, for when she's uh, eating snacks or if I pack like um, a f an extra food for her, um, instead of packing like the traditional bib, I'll just have one of these in my bags and if they're dirty, poof, they go in the wash. And uh, because she's like extremely teething now, this is a must for me, like I have to leave the house with that. Okay, also in my diaper bag, I carry uh, this little muslin cover. Um, this uh, I can link in the description box below, but basically it's a uh, breastfeeding uh, cover uh, as well as a cover for the bucket seat. She is no longer in her bucket seat, but um, this was really practical when we would go out with her. She just wanted to snooze in her car seat. Uh, we would just pull it over. It's a breathable material and um, yeah, like I use it for breastfeeding. I put it over her car seat. If uh, she's just laying on the grass and I don't have something for her to sit on, I'll put this under her. I'll cover her uh, with this blanket if she's cold. So just one of these in your diaper bag is very practical and it's got many purposes. And um, you know, you don't really need to bring like a blanket and then a cover for the car seat and something for the for to cover you while you're breastfeeding. You just bring one like that and basically 
that's all you need. <laughs> so if uh, I can just demonstrate it, uh, basically put it over your head like this. You latch your baby and you cover your baby as much as you can. <laughs> and that's it. Makes breastfeeding in public very easy. And it's a really cute pattern. And this will also be linked in the description box below. Uh, also, because it's the summertime, I will bring a little hat because you don't want uh, your baby's head to get overheated and, um, you know, sunburned. Uh, I also pack some sunscreen. This is from Think Baby. Usually I also pack some bug spray if I know that like I'm going out at nighttime um, or uh, if I'm going to like a camping or something like that. Uh, and lastly, uh, a little toy for her just to entertain herself, like if we're going to a family member's house um, and they don't really have anything that Ileana can, you know, touch and play with, I uh, bring just a little something small. The toy I'll usually change out uh, so it's not the same toy for her all the time. If things that she can snack on, so food stuff. And this I will keep in the pocket in the front because um, it's just con more convenient for me. If I need something, choof, I just go in there right away uh, and I'll pack uh, her bottle of water. This one is pretty cool because it comes with like a silicone um, cover. So if she drops it, I don't have to worry about it breaking or anything. Uh, also, I'll just bring a little a feeding spoon and a puree for her. So whatever I have, uh, like cut up fruits, cut up vegetables. Uh, and lastly, I carry some dry snacks for her and just some napkins, some cloths for spit ups uh, to clean her hands as she eats. All right, guys, so that is all that is in my diaper bag. <laughs> More often than not, uh, depending on what activity that we're doing, but if we're just going for like a little outing, this is all that I really pack. Um, I try to keep it as minimal as possible while thinking about everything. Entertainment, uh, diaper needs, uh, a change of clothes, what the baby will eat, if the baby is fussy, do I have her passy, uh, some teethers. So just keep all of that in mind when you're packing your diaper bag. And um, just a simple like to this video. And of course, if uh, you do like mommy uh, content, so definitely check that out and subscribe if you haven't already.